the best spot to see everything. Look, you can even see the edge of Kokoto from up here. Jibena, get down here and let's race. Koba, we all know you'd lose. Kibena runs faster and climbs better. Hey, forget racing. Look over there, a pond. That's it. Let's cool off in the water. It's so hot today. Uh, I don't think that's a good idea. What if the water isn't safe? <gasps> Do you hear that? Oh, Kibena. <laughs> You're always so careful. It's just a little pond. What's the worst that could happen? Yeah. Are you scared of frogs or something? You are not the one to be talking about being scared. Aren't you afraid of the dark? Uh, maybe Kibena's right. We've never swum here before. There's nothing strange about this pond. Uh, it looks normal. You're right, and the water doesn't smell. I have heard stories about people getting sick from parasites that live in water like this. <laughs> We'll be fine. Don't be such a chicken. <laughs> All right, team. This is it. Today is the day we make it to the big leagues. <laughs> Finally, goodbye, snail guts. Hello, human skin. <laughs> I'm going for the tall one. His legs look perfect for a good itch. Focus, team. The snail has done its job. Now it's our turn. Let's swim out and find human skin to enter and cause maximum trouble. No slacking. <laughs> hey boss, do we get bonus points if we give them joint pain? Absolutely. And don't forget, causing a fever is key. They won't see us coming. Now, on my mark, steady, steady, and go. I feel cold, but I'm sweating, and I can't stop trembling. <sighs> I feel so tired, too. Ooh, and my belly hurts. It hurts like I ate a whole basket of bad mangoes. Oh, Kibena, Amani, Barak and Koba are not feeling well today. Oh no, you two look terrible. What happened? <sighs> I don't know. I think I have a fever and I, I don't have any energy. Yeah, like there is a war going on inside me. It has to be the pond. Remember what I said? The water wasn't safe. Eh? Uh, pond? What pond? We found a pond in the forest and went swimming. But that was last month. Mm. We're not taking any chances. Let's go to the clinic right away. Mm -hmm. What seems to be the problem today? The boys swam in a pond last month. Now they're sick. One feels weak and the other has a bad case of diarrhea. Baraka, does it hurt when you pee? Mm. How about you, Koba? It doesn't hurt when I pee, but... I saw blood in my poo poo. Mm. We need to run some tests to be sure. But it sounds like you boys have a case of bilharzia. Bill. What? It's a common illness caused by parasites in contaminated water. Bilharzia is caused by tiny parasites. Scientists call them cercariae. See this snail in the pond? They release the tiny parasites into the water. And when you swim in that water, they can enter your body through your skin. But we didn't see them. They're so tiny. You cannot see them with your eyes. But once they're in your body, they grow into worms that feed on your blood and make you feel sick, causing fever, pain when peeing, stomach pain, and so on. And if not treated, they can damage your liver and bladder. W will we get rid of them? 
Yes, with the medicine I'll give you, you'll feel better soon. But remember, never swim in unsafe water again. Bilhazia isn't just in ponds. It can also come from rivers and lakes. Doctor, how can we tell if the water is safe? It's hard to tell just by looking. Even clean looking water can have parasites. If you're not sure, don't go in. Always ask an adult to help check if it's safe first. Mm-hmm. We'll make sure everyone knows. Nice. Um, and before I forget, it's also better to stay out of the water where people wash and take their animals to drink because these activities can contaminate the water further. What about water that people bathe in? Oh, that too. And also, don't poop and pee in the water. That contaminates the water too. <laughs>